Hi there, I'm Levana Fain. Welcome to Falmarim, episode 12. Okay, so Cal Selmo is ours. We do have him. He is converted fully. This episode, I think we're mostly going to focus on uh, food. Because <laughs> we have very low food. And unfortunately, there's only, <laughs> there's only one rabbit. One rabbit on the map. And we don't have a lot of animal spawns on these kind of maps. So I am going to have to send someone out. And it just so happens that in our quest log, we have two areas of interest. This one, the village screen. So out there is a village that I can go to, which will give me a lead on the initiate sewer, which is one of the, uh, the relics of my ideologian. Or I can go to this hidden structure robbing. So there's an ancient treasure in an ancient complex nearby. You know, I'll go for this one first. We might as well take out this hidden structure. Oh, that means I'm also going to have to do something with these prisoners. So I could... I mean, I could just remove their hearts and power these crystals with them. But that'll take a bit too long. I'll need to do surgery on them. I think I'm just going to release them. We'll get some goodwill from the faction when we release them, so that's probably the best idea. Oh, my growing area has actually been planted because it's, well, it's, it's minus four outside. That's, it's not great, but plants were thrown down. <laughs> okay, who do I want to send though? Uh, yeah, it's this one. Ancient complex. Okay. Oh, 0 0.61 days. That's not bad. Yeah, that's not bad at all. Yeah, that should all be good. They have points available. Okay, so I do want to reduce stamina costs. I think I'm just going to do that. I might do that. Increase the rate stamina is recovered. So I'll put one into fitness for her. All right, reduce the stamina cost on that. Increase the rate mana is recovered. Do a bit of clarity. Let's put Shadow Bolt all the way up. More clarity, I think. Yeah. I'll do clarity again. Yeah, let's reduce the costs on you. He's hunting a hare, but I can't... Oh, there it is. Hiding around that rock. Okay. Oh. Okay. Trectus has started a social fight with Kulamare. Brilliant. That's just what we needed. Her to be injured whilst on this caravan. Oh my gosh. Well, it's not bad. Can you talk him down? No. You can't. Well, put him down fast. Oh no, they're no longer fo social fighting. Okay. Well, honestly, I can't <laughs> believe that he did that right then. Uh, can you, can we heal her please? Yeah, go ooh, <laughs> that, that was close. That was close. They were very nearly slowed by an injured person. <laughs> Come on, Trictus. You're going to take that rabbit out. Hey, one of my prisoners has been let go. Nice, so we're just waiting for this one to be uh, released. Good. So we're at... I can't even remember where we were before. It literally just told me as well. 92, wasn't it? Because it's minus 12, right? Oh, plus 12. That's not bad. That's not bad, so why aren't you leaving? You can't walk. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> Excuse me. My caravan has been ambushed by a group of one members from the Radiant Dominion. They'll attack unless I give them Nenya. Um, no thank you. Who are you? How dare you? An Altma. Okay. Mad Surgeon. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, well, this was a bad idea, friend. That was a very bad idea. So Carolyn can go here. Cyrilind can go there. And you two can just hang around here for a sec while we draw him closer. Yes, because I thought you'd do that. Oh, awesome. Well... I don't want to be dragging a prisoner around. 
Let's harvest some food. And Genix. Genix? It's a panther. Ooh. Genetically altered hybrid of a lynx and a snow leopard. The Genix shares its genetic template with the frost lynx, both having diverged due to environmental pressure after their creation. Whereas the frost lynx is perfectly adapted to cold temperatures, the genix is usually found on milder climates, as it has a complex biological refrigeration system that allows it to decrease ambient temperature wherever it goes. If domesticated, this strange ability could perhaps be used to refrigerate an enclosed space. However, the genix has a tendency to explode if it receives too much damage, making it quite a fragile creature. Oh my gosh. Okay. It eats meat as well. Raw meat and corpses. You know what? That would be awesome. Melee attack him to death. Cyrilind. No, no usable food. Okay. That probably means that I need to butcher something. Uh, butcher creature. Now can you? What do you mean no usable food? Uh, oh well. Okay. Let's reform that caravan. And get going. Yep. Okay. And they should get there quite quickly. Hopefully. Uh, Trectus is finally being tended, but I think he only had bruises. Ugh, <laughs> shattered nose. Well, that's your own fault, isn't it? selmo has been drinking the cocktails. Of course he has. I don't think there's any other food, so of course he has. Trictus, you need to clean. Sorry to do this to you, but you also need to cook. Well, butcher, then you can cook. Ooh, ooh, okay, they've arrived. Okay, guys, what have we got? Okay. Ooh. Berries. Okay, I like this map. This map is good for us. A lot of elk as well, is that the only... Yeah. Alright. I think we're going to do the same thing as we did last time. Let's just harvest the map first. Because I don't know what's going to happen once we get into that complex. And I'd rather have some food in storage in our saddlebags in case we need to make a run for it hmm let's claim all that and then you can reinstall some of this over here throw on a roof and we can use this as our base okay enemies have been attracted to this site that should be fine. I shouldn't have a problem. Okay, what is going on over here? Alright, we've gotten rid of the other... Yeah, there he goes. Mm. Oh, meteorite shower. Please don't have dropped on the snow hair. Ooh, okay, so we've got compacted steel, more compacted steel, brilliant. Compacted machinery and slate. Alright. Mad snow hair. Is that the exact? Yep, that's the exact same snow hair. All downhill from here. Ah, oh, you missed. How could you miss? There we go. Nice. Up over there. Oh, we've got visitors as well. Gosh. And they have something to trade. Hopefully, food. Please, God, be food. Caravan animals wanders in. A group of royal ave abandoned our last wander in. They seem to have belonged to some caravan as they still carry packs with valuable items. You can collect these items if you tame them or kill them. Otherwise, they will leave the area in a couple of days. Ooh. Okay. What do you have? A bit of gold? A bit of silver? And nothing. Oh, okay. 
Oof, those are pretty. There's no way that they'll be happy in my colony though, so I think I'm gonna hunt them. And hope that they don't run off the map. So what do you have? Okay. Taken their packaged survival meat. Actually, Calselmo, I might want you to stay up here as backup for her tell when these royal aves eventually decide they actually want to eat him. Which is likely, to be perfectly honest. Gift from Istadistia. Nice, okay. My caravan has been detected. Reinforcing ancients from ancients will begin arriving in the area. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Tractus is hiding in his room. That's fine. Okay, everybody. Time to get this started. Okay. Kulame, move up. Okay. Dead Amy. Hmm, okay. Oh, okay, no. Coming out, we're coming out. <laughs> That's a bad idea. Okay. Yeah, let's uninstall that, I think. Uninstall the steel wall. Yeah. And then you guys can help beat it out. Okay, everybody. Let's get back to it. And this time... Where did you... Yeah, we can do that again, and this time we'll be a little bit more cautious. Although I don't know how more cautious I can be. Okay, so there is Ancient Comms Console and two Hermetic Crits so far. Don't think that does anything, no. Okay, so go up here. And be ready to run. Okay, okay, run. Leave, 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 leave. That's a shame. I... That's another hermetic crate. Mm. Nope, come on. It's going to start getting very warm in there. So what we need to do is take a wall out again. Repair. Not repair. God damn it. Uninstall. There we go. Ah, <sighs> okay. So, it looks like I might be... I might, I might just uninstall some walls right now. Ooh, okay. What are you doing? Cleaning urine. <laughs> okay, open the crate. Let's see what's in there. Advanced component, okay. Uranium, ugh, okay. That's just a machine. Storage cylinders, okay. And these are just boxes. Uh, open that one. In fact, could you load that onto a pack animal? Ooh! Ooh, Glitter World Medicine. Let's take that. Please. Oh. Oh. Well. 
Oh, honestly, really. Yeah, it's really lucky that I've taken the wall out because the temperature in these rooms would be horrible. <laughs> it would be terrible. Okay, you. Load uranium onto the pack animal. Yep. Oh, there's one more hermetic crate. Okay, so what's Nenya doing? Cleaning. <laughs> well, open that please. Let's see what's in here. What was that? Anyway, ancient operating table. Oh, right, it's a chem fuel. Alright, so there's hack progress. Okay. Linked to a supply satellite. Now that's... that could be good. I could get some supplies. The only thing is, that's a fast way of getting attacked. And I wanted to get out of here very quickly. Can these things even train to carry? No. So let's remove this from the animal area then. Yeah, you can stay out there. And so Carolyn, you can hack the supplies and we'll see what happens. Okay, pods have arrived with 210 apples. Mount that ave. Okay, we have a raid. Just those two? Is it just those two? It is. Okay, and you are... Ozima. Okay. Pyromaniac. And this one's a psychopath, but neither of them are mages. Okay. That's good. Right there. And you know what? You have grenades. That's not good. Nice. Okay. And you can get that one. You can get that one. There we go. Oh, sugar. No, run. Ooh, oh, that was so close. Honestly, Cyrilind. We need to be a bit more careful with that. Now, where's Sock Allen? What was he even... I didn't actually put him on to... Whatever. Load onto the pack animals, please. And then I think I will... I'll take on some elk. Why not? Okay, Cyrilind. Go for that one. Move out of the way. Okay. Yes, alright. Okay, so that's not as good as I had hoped, but it's definitely not bad. Okay. And let's get a little bit more of this done. Can I remove the flaws in here? That's carpet, isn't it? And I need carpet. Yes, okay, we've got more stuff to actually go after, and we have these. Echeters. I'm assuming Echeters. Might be Echeter. Attacking them might... Might be something I should leave until these guys have come home. But we can take on the rabbits. <laughs> we can take the rabbits. 23 hours that raid is going to arrive. You need to start working faster. 393. I think that's enough. 
Where are we? Let's reform the caravan and come home. Never rest, just come home. Are our crops actually growing? 49% grown, that's not bad. Oh, it's 9 degrees outside. That's amazing. Okay, that means our trees are actually trying to grow. 32%, 26. Ah, that's brilliant. Yes! Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Harvest. Oh my god, come home, please. Oh, they're so close. Of course, they're going to want to... <laughs> they're going to want to uh, sleep as soon as they get here, but... Ah, oh, brilliant. Oh, and they've abandoned you. Oh my gosh, you're sowing. <laughs> sowing trees. That might be a waste of time, I have to say. Oh my god, it's 18 degrees outside. Oh, okay, we've got a Fenrir hunt. Ooh, and it'll give me gold and an Eltex shirt. Okay. Nothasi, anima master of the Kaima pilgrims of St. Voris, has reported spotting a Fenrir nearby. While they don't plan on hunting the beast themselves, they're challenging you to hunt it. Should you be successful, they'll give me the following reward. It'll be there for the foreseeable future, but move on in time. I can use this moment to hunt it for its precious pelt, or try to tame it if I dare. Oof, gosh, I would love to try and tame it. I'm going to be honest, I would love to. I just... I don't think I can. Oh, it's not that far away either. But that's the point, isn't it? <laughs> that's the point of trying to tempt you into running away in to these sites to go and do extra quests. I'll leave you all on four. Just so that you will... We can get these walls smoothed. I didn't even think about that. I probably should have done. Um, what? Fifth of Sun's Seed is the date of the Oblation of Technology. But since the Uplifter of Steel roll is inactive, the Steelers will skip the Oblation of Technology. The Steelers. Oh, it's because of you! <laughs> it's your ideology. Okay. Yeah, you're a Steeler. Okay. I might... Uh, ask them to smooth all of this. Just because I have extra people to do it now. I do need to get him his own bedroom. That means mining this out. But yeah, that should be fine. Harvest. Do more harvesting people, please. Oh, oh, oh. Animal disease. Plague. One of my engorged tentacular aberrations has gotten the plague. Well, that's not good. Probably. Sarah Lind is going to uh, like to attend a party, so she has party frenzy. She'll re regain recreation twice as fast. Well, that's nice. Okay, so we actually have cloth now. Which means... Which means... Where are we? Fine carpet. Yes. So what colour do I want? I'm thinking kind of a... Blue or... Hmm. Blue or indigo. You know what? We'll do indigo just because it... It's going to be a nice royal colour, I think. So, yeah, that's a, lot of, that's a lot of carpet that we don't have. But we have some of it, so some of it will be done. I probably should have stayed and taken more of the carpet at that uh, site. Yeah, we don't have a lot of cloth, considering how much cloth is required for this. Anyway, you. Hey, average mood is 84. Well, that's good. <laughs> Hold that thought. 
Can't believe I'm having to prioritize this. Don't you realize how rare this is? And do the same for him, please. 70%. Okay. And your medical went up to 15. Oh, he's doing so well. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that's a lot of cloth used in just a couple of squares. And that's that's all of my cloth used, actually. So I'm going to have to remember the next time we get something like that. We need to take up the floors. We need the carpet. Exotic goods trader. Okay. Istadistia is coming along with an exotic goods trader. Oh my gosh. Orb of souls. Wow. A powerful and dangerous artifact. It requires no external power and can extract the soul of a pawn possessing traits. If successful, the Orb of Souls will absorb all traits from the target. The target will lose the absorbed traits. The process is almost always lethal. Once filled, the Orb of Souls can be used to transfer the absorbed traits into another human like Pawn. <gasps> That's cool. I definitely do not have enough money for it though. Wow. Wow. Okay, I need to somehow pay for that. Somehow. I think we'll stick with those. Yeah. You can haul that, please. And that. Yeah, thank you. I wondered where the rest of my money went. Ooh, so Orb of Souls. That might be interesting to use on someone. So if I find a prisoner that has fantastic stats, I can use the Orb of Souls and take those stats for myself. <laughs> okay, research finished for crossbows. Construct crossbows, a medieval ranged weapon effective against armoured enemies. Okay. So. Okay. Let's do some pottery. I actually need a heart. <laughs> so I could put some... Uh, a cold crystal in here or something. Yeah, I definitely need a freezer, which is an odd thing to say on this map, considering how cold it was previously. But yeah, these heating crystals are doing remarkably well, and outdoors, it's actually not in the minuses anymore. So, actually, the hydro jelly farm, what's... how do I... Okay, I need two. Two hive pieces. Uh, and it's not refrigerated, so I definitely need a walk-in fridge. Definitely need a walk-in fridge. But first, let's get some of these beds in. Well, we have a ton of elk as well to, to kill. Oh my gosh. Yeah, no. They'll immediately run straight off if I attack them. I'm going to have to wait for them to come out. I'll have to take out the Eshetev before that. It's not cold enough. Oh no. The temperature has dropped, it's two degrees. That might be enough. <laughs> that might be enough. You never know. But I think that's where I'm going to leave this, so... I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, hit the like button. I upload three videos a week, so subscribe and you'll be notified when those go live. Hit the bell to update your notifications. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.